then we are to understand that our children's lives are in the hands of the Zoning Board of Appeals. Not only our children, but your property that you're elected to protect. The Board of Zoning Appeals issues blasting permits. They have the right to issue them and the right to protect them. That right was given by this council. <laughs> I'd also like to point out to the council that when that Zoning Board of Appeals gave that, this room was packed, jammed, and running over with people so that there were people standing outside. Every person that did not have anything to do with Humphreys Enterprises, with the exception of three people, were against that permit being given in the first place because of the swimming pool full of children, because of our school property, our new building where the YMCA offices were, and it was given anyway. And it, it, here again, it gets very frustrating because we come in swarms and we ask and we ask and we ask and we get no place. And the only answer I see to stopping it on 11th Street and up here uh, because they just keep going. And, uh, and out here is that it be stopped once and for all, all stripping within the city of Norton. And I cannot believe that this body protecting the people of Norton cannot do that with an ordinance that would stand up and forth. I'd like to speak. Who is the head of this bond, the Board of Zoning and Appeals? Who's got control to make the law? I think it should go before the man that's a head. That's what I mean, you all, the town council has nothing to do with the board that's on the field. Is that right? Y'all have no say so? Their control, you have no say so. Well, they're not voted. They've not been voted. These are the people that's voted. They represent us. Who determines the law? These the people law. have been voted by us to represent us. Who decides the board of zoning and You deal. ask who the zoning board was. Farm Farmer, W.H. Rich Jr., Ed before Eugene Moore, Lynn, will leave Sherman, and Jim Vickers. I mean, who decides the board? We can't hear. Who appoints? I mean, who appoints? I mean, the decides so forth what the law is. Who would you go to to make the law change? That's what I was getting at. I mean, y'all have no connection with changing the law, right? Well, I'll tell you how to change it. To get a new council. I'd like to ask about another law. Is there a law that requires my child to go to school in that building? <laughs> Yes. No, I'm not going to take it anywhere. We built that building and we waited on it and we fought for it. And I've already earned the right that my child can go to that school. When it was unsafe before, I took them somewhere else for three years. <coughs> now, do they, do, there's a law that my child has to go to school. But is there a law that says they have to go there? Because they will not go there until that stripping or that blasting is stopped. We've had two. We've been lucky twice. And I think that's more than enough to ask. The reckless blasting has been done, I feel the same way you do. Like I'd also like Mr. to point Mayor, out that there have been we have a picture of George Washington, the founder of our country up there. Abraham Lincoln said, the hand that rocks the cradle rules the world, and these women have demonstrated tonight. Thirty years ago, there was a president of this country, and where did he, where did he say the buck stopped?